Take a moment right here Feeling like it's out gear Driving towards the sun With a rose and a gun Feel the wind in my hair Going nowhere I swear could give you more energy than this. It turned out that I got this kind of stomach flu thingy that the Belgians brought with them over here. And now I have it. And this is the first day of the workshops. I haven't puked yet. I was very close last night. I thought to keep it down because I kind of feel like once you throw up, it's kind of, uh, you know, the body admitting that you're sick and I'm not gonna admit that I'm sick. So now I'm just trying to get something to eat. Like I have my tea and that's pretty much what I can uh, manage to um, drink slash eat right now. This sucks pretty hard. But on another note, yesterday was so much fun. Me, Hannah, and her daughter, and Alyssa had like a girl's day out, kind of. And we uh, had lunch, and then we went to a really cool... It's a hotel, but it's very... Uh, it's hard to explain. It's, it's a little bit like kind of Tim Burton style or feeling to it, not really as dark but that mysterious kind of feeling and um, they have hidden rooms in on every floor on, in these two buildings so we ran around with Hannah's two kids then and her husband trying to find these hidden rooms so that was pretty that was pretty awesome and then we went to uh, this area called Old Mill uh, where they have a lot of shops gathered in one place. So we went to a spice store. So I got some tikka masala and other Indian spices for Christian because he loves to cook. And uh, then we went to a candy store. And you know, it's the you moment know, where you scoop out your own candy. That's kind of the only way we uh, have candy in Sweden. I know it's not that common in the States, but that's, you know, how we do it. Unfortunately, I, I couldn't eat anything, you know, when I got back home, but I'll, um, I'll hang on to it one day. Then uh, Hannah and her daughter had to go home, so me and Alyssa went for a little shopping spree, so we went to Victoria's Secret, and I bought a lot of stuff. I'm gonna show you a little bit later what I got, and yeah, we were, um, driving around to these different places. I don't remember the names of it, but we had a lot of fun. And I bought a lot of tea. Here's one of the new tea brands that I bought, and it's so good. It's called Orange Spice, and Hannah kind of made me fall in love with this. So now I'm in love with this. Oh, then Alyssa took me to a bar, and she made me try out a sour ale which was actually really good. I liked it. Then when I got back home, I was just gonna do a little bit of editing and have my uh, leftover mac and cheese and I started to feel really weird. I started to shake really bad and it was like I was freezing to death and I turned the heat up to like max and close the doors to my bedroom, so it was uh, like a sauna in there. Well, I was freezing, and I had this much uh, clothing on, and my big socks, these. No, it was horrible, it was horrible. I had to take two painkillers and then try to keep them down, and then when they kicked in, I started to feel a little bit better. Oh, that reminds me, I probably need to take another painkiller. I need to um, gather some energy, whatever I have left. Oh, I'm gonna picked up, be picked up in 25 minutes. I really need to, oh God. I need to get ready for work. Wish me luck.
We are here and ready to go. You just need to pop some pills first. Yay. My name is Jim. I'm not sure if anybody knows who I am. We're really happy that you guys are here. We're really happy that Selena is here. And we are really happy that you can be happier once we get Selena up here. <laughs> when we bring her up, I have to let you guys know that we have, uh, obviously you got your goodie bag. So that's all of the stuff for you guys to take home with you. So anyway, so that's kind of what we have planned for today. Does that sound like a fun time? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I will hand it over to Selena. Thank, Thank you. you. Well, hi. hi. Uh, welcome. I'm so excited to see all of you here. I hope you had a nice trip coming over here. I know some of you have been traveling quite far. So what's like the longest someone's been traveling up here? 20 hours. 20? Oh, okay, good. Yeah, it's going to take me about 21 hours to get back to Sweden. Oh. So, yeah. <laughs> Just bump on that. <laughs> so we're going to start off with structure. We're going to do a French ombre. And I'm going to show you a very quick and easy way to do an ombre. And we're going to do like a regular uh, well, French ombre. I'm going to walk around and help you as much as I can. Please take notes. You can absolutely take a lot of pictures. You can film. Uh, I have one rule though, and it's that when I do a demo, everything that I do for you is for your eyes only. Uh, because you have been traveling a long way, uh, you pay money, you have taken your time to be here and come here. Hopefully, I mean, the goal for you to be here is that you're gonna kind of stand out in the crowd. And you know, you have competition around you in your area and you want, you want to attract more clients. Well, I think we can just uh, kind of get started. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So this is one of the very few things I can actually eat when I'm sick or, you know, with the stomach. Uh, so, Jim got it for me. Yay, Swedish bread. Act normal, ignore me. So how are we doing over here? Ooh. Doing good. Doing good. Doing good. Getting our nails back on. Yay, looks good. Yay. It's just so. <laughs> Hello. Hey. Hey. Ah. Hey. Oh my gosh. What you doing? <laughs> Canva. Huh? Creating Facebook clips. Ooh. Oh, that's us. With Can You Find Selena? Yeah. Here I am. I'm just thinking, I've been taking turkey forever. Maybe <laughs> it's time for roast beef. Switch it up a little bit. Oh, yeah, maybe. Hmm. Yeah, roast beef it is. I'm a minor in math, physics, and biology. I almost have a minor in accounting, business, and computer science. Numbers are making sense to me. Yeah. Yeah. Numbers make sense to me. Okay. So, um, I'm here to answer your questions. I don't know everything about everybody's life, but I know a lot about everybody's life. So, pardon? How many do you make? We make about 28 of them at this point. So, we're a manufacturer, and when I'm done with my speech, I'm going to give you a quick tour of the building. So, what we do is we actually manufacture a bunch of subsystems here from a funnel lab. And light elegance is just one of those systems that we make. So now the group is downstairs, they're doing the lab um, behind the scenes tour. I just got a little bit chilly again. Hello. So I just grabbed two more painkillers. Hopefully it's gonna kick in in a bit. What do you say, Hannah? Just <laughs> You could totally do like the Kermit thing. Oh, I'm Kermit, and you're like a regular person. You can ask. You can ask. You you have seen the meme with Kermit? No. Yeah, you have. You haven't seen it? No. Yes, you. Yeah, Kermit. I know Kermit. Is. Yeah, and he has like a hoodie thing. No, not not like a hoodie. He's like um, Jedi. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So I, if I'm Kermit, you can ask me something. I'll say that you need it or don't need it. Do I need 
pizza? Yes. <laughs> yeah, baby. Yeah, yeah, baby. Try to keep the motion quite big so you don't go nee, 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 in the middle. Try to make it quite big so you get a nice big transition. So there you go. Now after you cure that, do you put a builder gel over the top of yeah, that? Yeah, I would build over this. Mm -hmm. So whenever I do glitter, I build on top. Thank you. You're <laughs> welcome. <laughs> Let's do um, the ombre, yeah. the color ombre. First of all, we need to talk about colors because when we're doing we're doing an ombre, you can you can make it hard for yourself. Or you can make it easy. So if you want to make it easy, you pick colors that are next to each other. This one and this one are close to each other. Those two, those two, those two, and those two. So that's what I'm gonna... Okay. <laughs> okay, no. Let's go with orange. <laughs> Do you see a little string? Yeah. Yeah. So that is kind of my, um, my thread. This is what I'm gonna sew with. And this is where I know a lot of people start yelling at me saying that it's not working. When I did the sewing, it doesn't matter, it could be a mix of apple and lemon, I don't care. But after this, you will have a solid pair, nothing else. I don't want to see any lemons or apple in this. <laughs> so, in the middle, it's gonna be pear only. What makes this not look like an ombre? The, the lines, yeah. So, obviously we need to take care of that before we cure. Because if I cure this, you have the lines in there, and it's not gonna look like an ombre. If you screw this up, I have some tips and tricks for you. <laughs> you always need to have that. Step number three. Let's say you messed it up like totally. It's it's a total mess. You go in with black and you paint it all black. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> <Ooh>, pretty. <huh? laughs> hey, since I mm -hmm, yep, sure. I have something for you. Ooh, because. I once had two Jack Russells. Oh, really? And I know what it's like to miss them when you're away. So I got you, oh, I got oh, you a traveling Martin. No! No! <laughs> no. Oh yeah. my god. Well, thank you. Oh, that's so sweet. And you can take selfies with him all the special places you go. Oh, he's so gonna come with me everywhere. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> Mini Martin. Mini Martin. It's Mini Martin. My Jack Russell is named Skip from the movie. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, my god. Oh, I'm gonna cry. Oh. Miss Martin. <laughs> Thank you. You're so welcome. You'll have to make him a little collar or something. Oh yeah, totally. Yes. Oh. <laughs> I got a Martin! <laughs> Martin, I've always wanted to meet you. Oh, I got a Martin. Look at this. Yeah, it's gonna come with me everywhere. class is uh, over. The students are downstairs uh, buying products because you know they have 20% off. Pretty awesome if I would say. And you know me and Minnie Martin just chilling out a little bit. Um, I'm very happy that I didn't collapse today. It was hard but I would say it was a lot easier than I thought it would be. I'm thrilled that I actually was able to eat something and have lunch uh, because I feel like that's kind of a deal breaker. Uh, I was, you know, I haven't had food from where uh, we were having lunch yesterday and then until now. So, you know, of course, I I felt pretty shitty <laughs> because I had no energy. I had to take another dose of painkillers during lunch, but other from that, you know, of course, I'm I'm super tired. I have a hard time concentrating and my mind is kind of like everywhere, but I must say that it went very well. So now, you know, I'm just going to go home, sleep, 
just relax and get ready for tomorrow. I think I'm actually gonna end the vlog right here. I'm gonna be way too tired to keep vlogging. I really, really hope you like this vlog, even if I'm not super energetic. I try the best as I can, but you know, vlogs, it's all about real life and this is real life. Sometimes you, you're sick and you have to work. This is real life. This is how it is. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, thumbs up, all that stuff, you know. You already know that. And uh, I will see you in the next vlog. It's gonna be from tomorrow with the next class. And hopefully I will feel a little bit better by then. Take care, guys. Good night. To my boss that I'm done. Had no luck with my mom. Say, what will you do with your life? You know it's hard to survive A cigar in my mouth Maybe guilty but proud Now I'm an outlaw on the road